Okay, here we are. It's now time for part 5, I believe. And yep, on the last time game I made it the longest. And yep, hopefully this one on this new game I will be even. I will be going even further. Okay, two missiles, one drone part and twelve scrap. And not so huge damage. And yeah, why I disabled my missile was simply because I didn't want to waste it since I had already shut down his shields. So yeah, once again it has shields. Weapons down, but <laughs> yeah, yeah, I used my missile simply because bit bad the situation there. I don't know, was it too much after all? But yeah, at least I won it. And to the next one, okay. Yeah, this is the bad thing. Too often I find myself in a position where I can't go anywhere else, turn backwards. Again, same kind of ship. I don't know, I think I make more shields this time. Yeah, I think I need the missile here. Fire on ready. That was close, one few, okay. Sir is a bit injured. Let's heal him up. Yep, yeah, let's keep going. I can like, proceed from here towards the exit. 
Okay, uh, nearby planet show signs of habitation and create beauty. Uh, rudimentary automated planetary defense system is looping its message into space. Warning, quarantine level 5 in effect under FHA Act 12, 22, uh, Article 11.2. Warning, quarantine level 5. Now what map does it actually mean? This is also funny when it doesn't actually show what it means. Yep, I don't care. Let's just move on. doesn't have any drones, so that's good on my part. Yep. I save a missile here. Okay, two missiles, one drone part and two elf scrap, but it seems there is fire on my engine. And I know it might have as well spread. But yeah, thank god it hasn't. Leads to a remarkable binary star system. The view is beautiful, but there is nothing else around. Okay, so yeah, I think I had to exit. Okay, next sector, and let's head to Nibble. You enter a sector thick with nebulas, you will have to navigate to ins navigate on instinct. Oh. Okay. I think this is a pretty good way. Uh, you jump into a sector of nebula beset by a plasma storm, an automated rebel scout station that the beacon moves into attack. Shit. <coughs> okay, yeah, what this means is simple that... Yeah, I have half the power in available. Oh, 
Ah shit, yeah, I have no freaking way. Oh yeah, thought I forgot that I had no shield power. So yeah, all we can do is restart. That was a bit short in game. Uh, let's head to this rest car. Uh, you find a number of ships fleeing from small space station. You hail them, asking what's wrong. Help, we are being overrun by some sort of giant alien spoilers. And I could help them or leave them alone. I think I'm gonna help them, even that might cost me one crew member. Uh, your crew boards the station, cautiously moving between the corridors. Suddenly a man-sized arcanic burst from a vent in the ceiling, followed by countless more. You fight your way back to the airlock and are forced to leave before accounting for crew members. Not everyone made it back. <coughs> Fine. Yeah, I know one thing that it's really hard to actually do anything with only two crew members. <laughs> and here up some shot. Yeah, I know my oxygen is out. My shield is burning. When the rebellion is complete, you will see the safer world we provide. Well, you won't, but you get the point. They are more weapons. Yeah, I forgot I have this new weapon. Fires one missile that's three damage, pierces or shields. Guess what I'm choosing? That's three damage, this does two damage. Okay, yeah. I have no use to use this weapon at all then. Okay, it's really slow shooter, but yeah, I hope it's not a big deal. Thank you. 
Yeah, I'm not sure if this is actually a good one, but it uses all my missiles here. Yeah, I need to use laser. I need to destroy the engine. Yeah, okay, that weapon is basically not good after all because it uses my missiles. And yeah, I have limited stock. That. Uh, you receive a guest. All of our mini military ships have been destroyed or damaged during the rebellion. The rebellion. However, they have been reported of Mantis War Camp only a few jumps from us. Can you help? Yes, I can help. But yeah. Thank you, if you can just give us a count of their numbers, perhaps we can get the rebels to help. Scrap 15, add that quest marker to your map. But let me guess, there is no quest marker. And wait, the rest to ease. Mm. Yeah, straight away head here. Okay, you find Tementis encampment, but there are far too many of them to count accurately. You send a long range message back to the settlement with your findings, but unfortunately, there is not much you can do. It would be suicide to attack directly. Um. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna try to shoot them. Let's see what happens. <laughs> you fire at their few depot, but the shot from the surface rips to them, rips the missiles to shreds. They must have planetary defense system set up already. You can you try to get away, but nearby patrolship moves in to attack. And yeah, who was the? Smart as who wanted to actually attack there. But thank god he doesn't have drones, so this should be easy peasy. I got one for one drone part and 40 scrap. Yeah, I think this should have done some good things to my quest. Because I actually destroyed someone. Let's see. Yeah, I think I go to the distress location. You find the source of a distress call, a small research station. It happens to a small laboratory fire got out of control, is threatening to destroy the station. Their fire suppressive system is not responding. Yeah, what I know from previous is that if I select the option 2, I will get one crew member. Yeah. Let's try to help them. I ah, know this must cost me once again a crew member. You sent your crew into the station, unfortunately, as soon as they entered the fire precates the station fuse and contaminant, you quickly try to dock and retrieve your crew, but not before an unfortunate show is lost in the inferno. So yeah, it basically seems 
that you can't help on that quest. Well, yeah, this is the past end of part 5. I will continue my journey with only two crew members on part 6. I'll see you guys then. <laughs>